In this video, I'm going to try and print from my brand new Nexus 5 phone. So let's get to it. Now, in the past, there have been ways to print from your mobile device. But with Android 4.4 KitKat, printing is getting more integrated into the operating system. And for somebody like me who prints, I don't know, I don't print a lot, but I do have to print on a regular basis, it's a welcome addition. Now, before we get into this too much, I have to tell you that I actually was able to set up Google Cloud Print in my house. Now, if you're familiar with my channel, you know that I've had a lot of problems setting up Google Cloud Print. In fact, I think I did two videos on it, and both of the videos were not very successful. But when I wasn't filming, I was able to actually set up Google Cloud Print. Now, if you're not familiar with Google Cloud Print, I'll just give you a quick rundown of it. Basically, it's Google's solution on how to interface your printer with your device. And usually that device is an Android device or a Chrome OS device. And there's actually two ways to accomplish it. You can go and buy a cloud print enabled printer, and that's the easiest way because you can actually communicate with the printer directly from your Android or Chrome OS device. In my case, I have an older Wi-Fi printer. It's a Canon printer. I actually did an unboxing on this channel of it. And it's not cloud print enabled. In my case, I have to route my print jobs from my Android device or Chrome OS device through a Windows PC. And then the Windows PC sends the print job to the printer. So it's a little bit more a roundabout way to do it, but it still works. And in my case, I'm very fortunate because I actually have a Windows PC that I have on quite a bit because it's my DVR. And this is actually my DVR. Now, it's been a real hectic year for me, and I haven't posted as many videos as I've wanted to, and I haven't even posted all the videos that I filmed. I actually bought this a little over a year ago, and I set it up as my DVR in my house. And... I don't have it on all the time, but I have it on a lot because obviously being a DVR, it's going to record the programs on TV that you want to watch, so it's got to be on in order to do that. I don't have any cable boxes in my house. I basically rolled my own DVR here. And don't worry, all those videos are filmed, even the unboxing of this, which was done over a year ago. I will post those to the channel still when I have time. It's just been, like I said, a very hectic year. But this is the computer that I route my Google Cloud Print through. So, like I said, generally it's on, not all the time, but, you know, when I need to print, it's generally on. And the key to setting up Google Cloud Print is, is that I have Chrome as a browser on this device, and I'm signed in to my Google account that's registered to Cloud Print. Now, you can have, if you have multiple Google accounts like I do, you can actually share the printer that you have associated with your Gmail account. So for instance, this is signed in always with the same username and password. If I'm in, let's say, another Gmail account on my Android phone or my Chrome OS device, as long as I have that printer shared with that other Gmail address, it prints no problem, very seamless. So again, in summary, if you have a cloud print enabled printer, you don't need the Windows PC as an intermediary, but if you're like myself and you have an older printer or even a new printer that's not cloud print enabled, you're gonna need an intermediary PC. So let's go up to where my printer is. I'm actually in my living room right now. We're gonna go up to one of the bedrooms where the printer is. For now, I'm gonna actually move it up to my office when I'm finished with my office. And I will actually show you on the phone, I'm going to print something, probably a web page. I'm going to print on the printer and we'll see what the performance is. So let's go up there. Okay, so here's my Canon PIXMA MX410, my Wi-Fi printer. And off to the right is actually my wireless router. So on the phone here in settings, you actually now have in Android 4.4, you actually have a printing option here. And as you can see here, you have print services, cloud print on. So if I click on that, you see that I have my Canon MX410 series printer selected there, or actually one of the selections there. These other selections like the Nexus 4 and, and whatnot, I don't really need. But um, cloud print 
strangely enough, also allows you to save things as a PDF. So you don't always have to print, you could actually just save it as a file, and that's what these this Nexus 4 and Nexus 5 is. Uh, let's go back. Now it says HP Print Service Plugin. Now, HP obviously is synonymous with printers, among other things, but um, they're, they're a little more advanced in, in their options for printing. I remember when I had my WebOS tablet, you could print directly from the WebOS tablet onto an HP printer, no problem. But uh, let me just click on that. As you can see, it says searching for printers. I don't have any HP printers, so it's not going to find any HP printer on my Wi-Fi network here. So, But that is an option if you do have an HP printer. So let me pull up a website on here, and I'm actually going to try and print the website. So I have the full web page of my YouTube channel here, and I'm going to go up to the settings button over here. And if you look all the way down here, you have a print option here. So I'm going to hit that. And as you can see, Canon MX410 series printer is already selected. And number of copies, all this looks good. I'm going to hit print down here. And it's going to generate the print job. And it's going to communicate over my home wireless network. Send my print job down to my computer, my Windows PC computer and then the computer is going to send the print job up here. So let's see how long it takes. It looks like uh, it's communicating right now and it's printing it out. So very cool, very handy, and you can actually use this to print when you're not at home. So if I was on the road, Right now I don't have a SIM in here yet, but I will hopefully within the next day or so. If I was out on the road and I wanted to print something at the house here, I could send the print job. It would communicate with my computer and the computer would send the print job here and the printout would be waiting for me when I got home. So very, very cool. So let's see what this looks like when it's printed out the web page. I don't have huge hopes for it as far as formatting goes, but as you can see here, the logo didn't come out, but my my little icon did, and did a pretty good job. So it's a really cool option, as far as I'm concerned, because I do a lot of printing. Not a great deal of printing, but I do need to print from time to time. Here's the other page right there. So that's Google Cloud Print and the new print functions that are working their way into Android. So that's going to do it for this video. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. If you like what you see, please subscribe. And as always, if you want to help out my channel, give me a thumbs up or share this video. So thanks so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.